King Charles has always had a penchant for one of his quirky hobbies, which used to leave his mother, Queen Elizabeth II, quite tickled, according to royal expert Jenny Bond. The king is renowned for his love of the great outdoors, with many of his initiatives centered around open spaces. The 75-year-old monarch has a particular fondness for mazes. He recently had a new maze garden constructed at his royal Sandringham estate in Norfolk, inspired by the intricate labyrinth he enjoyed as a child. Jenny Bond, former BBC royal correspondent, spoke with OK about Charles' new maze, suggesting that the late queen would have been amused to see her son still indulging in the same pastimes he loved as a youngster. She also highlighted how the king's mazes will form part of his legacy. I am sure the late queen would have been quite amused that her little boy was indulging one of his quirky hobbies, finding his way out of a maze. He used to spend hours trying to get round the maze at Sandringham when he was a child. That maze was dismantled years ago but now it has been rebuilt dot and is even better, Jenny told the publication. The latest maze at Sandringham marks the third royal maze in 300 years. Charles had one erected at Dumfries House in Ayrshire in 2016, featuring a Japanese-style pagoda at its heart, and another at Balmoral in Aberdeenshire, designed in the shape of Scotland's national flower, the thistle. Jenny highlighted that Charles will derive great enjoyment from seeing his grandchildren delight in the mazes throughout their young years. The mazes will also be accessible to the public, offering royal enthusiasts a chance to experience them. Jenny went on to say, the king has also masterminded one at Balmoral, shaped like a thistle as well as at Dumfries House. They will be quite a legacy for the king, and I think he'll get great enjoyment from watching his grandchildren and, indeed the public, trying to find their way out. Of course the king's mazes are extraordinarily elegant and beautiful. Charles, who loves beauty and nature, wouldn't have it any other way. The Thistle Maze at Balmoral was inaugurated in August, while the maze at Dumfries House was opened back in 2016. The new maze at the Sandringham estate is also now open to the public.